I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Back in my bag. Back in your bag. Back. Been gone so long. I almost forgot. What is up, guys? It is Josh the Sauce. It's a little bright in here. The whole point of this little recording is because I record a little something different. You know what I'm saying? A little in real life, something, something. And all it is is me cooking with Josh the Sauce. Yes, it's a thing. I'll put it up on the screen, like right here. Pretty much. I did a video on it because, bro, it's literally me. I'm pretty sure they made it after me. Like, why wouldn't they? It's a little different. Like, if you guys don't want to watch it, like, by all means, you don't have to. Just something. I literally just. It's a cooking video, okay? Now we're here in the kitchen right now, right? We're gonna start making the chicken rice sauce. Now, we got our chicken right here. I already defrosted it, or whatever you want to call it. So let's snag this bad boy right out. Oh! Oh, look at that. Oh, snap. That's some good looking chicken. So we're probably gonna cut this chicken. All right, so let's get a knife. So we're gonna cut our chicken into little pieces. So one, that's, oh. That's pure. That's pure chicken. All right, let's go. Two. <laughs> this is pure chicken breast, I think, or something. Something along the lines of chicken. Right now, the content's a little dull, so I'm probably gonna cut till the end, or I'm gonna time lapse it. We're switching knives. So as you guys can see, we, we got the chicken all cut, prepared, and ready, baby. And what we're gonna do now is we're gonna cook the rice. And um, then what we gotta do, I'm just gonna wing this and put this pan right here. You wanna turn your pan number to about four, five, five, and let it heat up. Now, what we wanna add first, you wanna add, we wanna add the oil, not the chicken. So to get oil, you need to buy it from the store. And that's why we bought oil at the store. You know, you just need 100% pure canola oil complement Sobeys. If it's not 100% pure canola oil complement Sobeys, it's not the right oil and you're not gonna make this right. This is the Josh sauce recipe. They named this after me, bro. Named after me, okay? Don't ever disrespect the name. Now you wanna add about, about a centimeter worth of oil, perfect amount of And you wanna really let that soak around the pan because if it doesn't the pan's gonna be not oily and we don't want that they call me chef they call me the sa saucy chef sa chef sauce man now that it's heating up what we're gonna do is add the chicken because the rice you're gonna heat it up you're gonna burn that if you put that in it's already heated up in the microwave we need to add the chicken and get that cooking am I right I am right all right all right so let's put the chicken on now you get it on the thing remember the technique you see in those really fancy cooking video things they're like oh snap I'm gonna make a water slide for the chicken and all the baby chickens go wee into the pan look at them go they're having so much fun <laughs> these ones are not they are scared of death. Now, what I'm gonna use is this fancy thing I call a wooden piece of trash. It's a spatula, you can carve this yourself. I actually carved this one myself, made it of trees from rotten outside on our deck. That made no sense. That's good looking chicken right there, baby. Technique with chicken. Move it around, baby. Gonna make sure it's flippity floppity all over there. All these pieces of chicken need to be cooked, not, not raw. Now one more thing we forgot, every chef, you already know my name baby, needs their apron baby. Fashion. Fashion. Now once I learn how to tie a tie, we're gonna get on to this chicken. I don't know what to tie a tie, so we're just gonna leave it like this. Anyway, I got my apron on, and a technique that I was shown by my mother, you cut the chicken like this to make sure it's not pink. You need to cook your chicken to make sure it's not pink. Now, as you can see, all this chicken is nice golden chicken. You can make chicken nuggets out of this chicken. Now that the chicken is all done, no pink, pretty brown, we are gonna add the best part, the part that makes this video the friggin' Josh sauce. We're opening it, look inside there. Oh my land, that is looking mighty fine. We're gonna dump the whole bottle, you heard me, the entire bottle 
Sauce is still on me. It's dripping and flowing. It looks like I'm bleeding. I don't need consoling. Why is there chunks in my sauce? I did not sign up for that. We're good. We're good on that. And now what you want to do is mix it around. You got to get all the chicken all saucy in there, baby. No chicken left behind. No chicken breast left behind. You see the way I'm going? You see the way I'm stirring? That's what you want to do right here. See this? Oh my goodness. James Harden couldn't even do this, bro. He's not even stirring the pot like me. Our sauce to chicken ratio is kind of high. I wanted to do two chickens, but no, we're doing one. I should have done two because there's a lot more sauce in here than chicken. We're gonna do something very special. Now, I'm gonna taste test this sauce, make sure it's hot. Pretty sure it's hot enough. Honestly, whatever your brand name is, Patak's or whatever the frig their name is, Patak. I think it's called Patak. Yeah, Patak. You need to take the chunks out of my sauce. I'm sorry to be very complaining, but bro, you have chunks of tomatoes in my sauce. Did I say I like tomatoes? No, I freaking didn't. So what are you doing? Look at that, that's, oh, does that not look, oh my land. We got our rice, okay, we need to get a nice fork. What? <laughs> and you need to take your rice, which you heated in the microwave with water, because that's the simplest way to do it. It's called instant rice, I didn't know that was a thing. I am dumb, sorry. And you wanna move it up, you wanna move it all around, instant rice it, baby, instant rice it. And then what you're gonna do is take some scoops and put it on your plate. Don't wanna burn a, oh, smell the, Smell that. We gotta get a good patty of rice. You gotta make sure you shape it nice too. You can't, the presentation is key. Like if Gary, what's his name? What's his name? The guy from MasterChef, his name, the guy who thinks he's all that. He can come at me, because my presentation is off the chain. That's enough rice for now. We're gonna leave that. Now for the, the part we've all been waiting for. Uh, yeah. Welcome to paradise. Hey. Think she love me that. I don't know she might. She gon' come around. Only when the lights on. Every as you can see, what does this look like, guys? Now, this is for the final taste test. Now, you want to mix it around. Get You want to get a good consistency of sauce, rice, and chicken. I haven't eaten yet, so I'm kind of excited. This is my first bite. Holy macaroni. What can I say? I'm a chef. Excuse me for a moment. One thing that I'm realizing is, I think this sauce did such a good job of replicating me. It tastes so much like me, I don't like it. Why would you want to taste like me? Now that's, they did a good flipping job. Now if you want this sauce, baby, you need to cop some right now. Maybe if you want, I'll do another cooking video. I probably won't. Here, you guys can finish this off for me and uh, See y'all on the next one. Sip it with a spot from the upper. Nice that I feel pretty down low. Fast with a pedal, don't come slow. Riding with no gasoline. Take them out, thought they speed out.